Hi everyone, I'm Simon from Roland Australia. Today I want to cover one of the most frequently asked questions, which is, out of all the V-Drums kits, what are the differences? A simple way to remember it is that there are actually only five kits in the V-Drums range, starting with the HD3, the TD4 KP Compact Kit, the TD11, the TD15, and the TD30, which is the flagship mother of all kits, the one that you want. And we're going to go through the differences now between all the kits, play a little bit, and hopefully that will give you a better understanding of the V-Drums range. So let's start at the HD3, which is the latest generation of our V-Drums light kit. This is an all-in-one kit. It's actually a design award-winning kit for the way it's constructed because the bass drum pedal and the hi-hat are totally isolated from the floor for the first time. So you don't get any vibrations through the floor to annoy anyone in a nearby bedroom who's trying to sleep. This is a very simple kit to use in that it has 10 fantastic drum kits that are very varied in sound for playing anywhere from rock to metal, fusion, jazz, funk, percussion, whatever it is that you're practicing. It also has a metronome function built in, a mix input for connection to an iPod, and also a MIDI out. And this actually allows you to compose, record, notate your drums inside a Mac or a PC. So a typical user of the HD3 would be a student, first time drummer, a teacher with multiple kits in a classroom, or even a professional studio where it's being used in the control room as a trigger kit or for working with artists in close proximity. That's the HD3. Next kit in the range is the TD4KP, often called the compact kit for very good reason. It can be packed up and put over your shoulder, fits in a small bag. One of the great features about the TD4KP is that the bass drum trigger is built into the rack itself and it can take a conventional mechanical bass drum pedal. So any acoustic drummer will feel immediately at home on the TD4KP. In terms of specs, the TD4KP features the TD4 sound engine, which is a very popular sound engine. 25 kits, which you can customize the tuning and pitch and muffling of with 128 sounds and great coaching functions that allow you more than just a metronome to actually see whether you're playing in time or out of time. It also features recording, a mix input for connection to an iPod or any other multimedia device, also a MIDI output for recording and composition with your computer, Mac or PC. So a typical user of the TD4KP could be anyone learning drums for the first time. It could also be for gigging drummers who are going to rehearsals where they don't want to take their entire drum kit and also for small studio spaces where you need a programming kit that you can use for connection to other programs or for composition and recording where space is a premium. That's the TD4KP. So the next kit is the TD11. In the TD11 series, there are two models, the TD11K featuring rubber toms and the TD11KV featuring mesh pads and toms and upgraded cymbals. In terms of the specifications, they share the same sound engine, which is 50 great sounding kits, 190 instruments. You can tune and edit your kits. There are play along songs to practice to, coaching function, recording. There's also USB, which is used for MIDI and audio and also wireless connectivity, as well as loading and saving your kits and even putting MP3s into the kit to play along to your favorite music. There's also a mix input for direct connection to an iPod or a multimedia device, as well as conventional MIDI output and there's even an extra port for expanding the size of the kit if you want to add another cymbal or a pad or a bass drum. Typical users could be students, teachers, anyone with a rehearsal space, perfect. And also for anyone, especially metal drummers who are practicing their riffs and their double bass drum playing. So that's the TD11 series. The next kits in the range are the TD15 series. And I say kits because there are two models. There's the TD15K and the TD15KV. The 15KV is different in that it has VH11 hi-hat, which mounts on a conventional hi-hat stand, which a lot of acoustic drummers will feel very at home with. It also features upgraded cymbals and pads. As far as the specifications of the modules go, again, they have the same module on each of the kits. So the TD15 brain, which has hundreds of fantastic drum sounds. All the kits are edited and tunable. There's even a quick edit function on the front of the module which allows you to edit tuning, muffling while you're actually playing on the kit without having to dive through menus. There are play along songs, recording function, USB audio and MIDI, two extra trigger inputs for expanding. You might want to have a side snare and an extra floor tom or a crash and an extra snare. There's no problem with the TD15. And one of the main feature differences is that there is a routable click which you can send just to your headphones to help you keep in time on stage. Typical TD15 players are drummers coming from an acoustic kit background that need all the advantages of an electronic kit, especially if they're using it on stage and they need a click that can be sent 
adjust to their headphones. It's also a very good kit for acoustic drummers who are used to a hi-hat mounted on a conventional hi-hat stand. Other users of the TD-15 are obviously students, teachers and anyone that's practicing the drums. So now we get to the top of the range series, the TD-30. There are two models in the range of TD-30, the TD-30K and the TD-30KV. The differences between the two are that the TD-30KV features two floor toms. It also has upgraded pads and cymbals, a VH13 hi-hat, which is our brand new super sensitive hi-hat. It also features an upgraded heavy duty rack that's slightly larger than the TD-30K. As far as specs go, the TD-30 kits feature the fantastic TD-30 sound engine. This is the most incredible sounding drum module that Roland has ever produced and that is available on any kit in the world. It's supernatural technology technology allows you to play with incredible nuance and detail that you've never heard before from an electronic instrument. The other fantastic features on the module are the built-in mixer on the front that allows you to adjust settings and volume levels while you're playing on the fly. The TD-30 also features 10 individual outputs, letting you connect your kit to a conventional mixing console or stage box. Each channel will come up as its own separate channel on the front of house console, which is a major professional feature of the TD-30 sound module. The other great things are the fact that all of the kits are editable, but not just editable for pitch and tuning, but also for microphone positioning and even depth of the drum, type of drum head. You can even use brushes on the TD-30 sound module, which is something unique to V-Drums and only available on the TD-30 series of V-Drums kits from Roland. Other features of the TD-30 module are USB inputs, which allow for storage, loading and saving kits and patterns, and also for wireless connectivity. And there's also a USB port, which is used for MIDI and audio transmission to and from your computer. So you no longer need an audio or MIDI interface to record your drum parts. Also the expansion capabilities of the TD-30 module are enormous. It has MIDI inputs and outputs and extra inputs for adding pads and cymbals. You can chain several modules together to make a mega system or even integrate a TM2 trigger module for samples or an SPDSX for recording audio on the fly and integrating it with your TD-30 kit. Typical users of the TD-30 series are, well, you. Basically anyone who's ever picked up drumsticks or wanted to will love the TD-30. You'll find them all over the world on TV and stage, including shows like American Idol and The Voice, and being used by musicians as diverse as Michael Shack from NetSky, Stevie Wonder, and even Neil Peart from Rush. So thanks for watching. I hope this has made choosing a V-Drums kit a bit easier for you, but the real test is to go into the store, grab a pair of sticks, and try the kit. You won't be disappointed. Thanks for watching.